Let's go save some money this week. Amazon Credit Builder. Hey guys, my name is Paul with Sunset Realty. And if this is your first time here, please subscribe and hit that bell notification so you don't miss any of our next videos. Let's go. Amazon Credit Builder is yet another secured credit card for those of you who are trying to rebuild or build your credit from scratch. And it works just like any other secured card. You put down a deposit and that deposit becomes your credit limit. And according to Amazon, they will give you your account after the first seven consecutive payments for an upgrade to an unsecured credit card. And after your account is reviewed and approved for an unsecured credit card, your deposit gets refunded to you. Now, is Amazon Credit Builder perfect? No, none of them are. Just remember guys, secured credit cards are for those of you who's trying to rebuild or build credit from scratch. Secured credit cards are meant to be temporary. Get in, get out. You're trying to get from point A to point B. We are giving Amazon Credit Builder a thumbs up because you are eligible to get 5% cash back to Amazon Prime. This is the only secured card that I know of so far, giving cash back or rewards. Maybe you guys can let us know in the comment below if you know any other secured credit cards doing this right now. We have a whole playlist on credit and here is why. One, well, we want to save you money. The first step of saving any money is keeping more of what you have and not having any credit will make it harder and harder for you every day. You need credit to, to get a good job, to get insurance, to rent a property, to buy a property, to buy a car, anything that you do now, you need credit. Not having any credit or no credit at all will hurt you. Just so you guys know, we're not just sitting here and blowing smoke. We actually practice what we preach. Temporary loss of few points there because I had to get this. I had to get this. This card paid me $500 just to be in my wallet and give me cash back on anything pretty much I spend on it. When we, when we come here and telling you guys this thing, we, we're actually speaking from experience and then we actually do exactly what we, what we are telling you. And so let me show you an example how improving your credit can save you a lot of money. Let's go buy a car together. Let's go. For the sake of argument, we're financing a flat $25,000 over five years. After taxes, transfers, dealer fee. We have three different credit scores. We have a 500 credit score, a 650, and a 780. 500 credit scores, 29.95%, that's finance charge. 650, 7%, and 780, 1.89%. Let's look at the monthly payment. With a 1.89%, your monthly payment is at $436.99. With a 650 credit scores at 7%, your monthly payment is at $495.03. And check this out. With your $500 credit scores, your with your 29.95%, you're at $808.07. Okay, so let's look at the saving. With your 780 credit scores, you're actually saving $371, just over $370 a month versus if you had a 500 credit scores. And with those 650 credit scores, your savings is about $313. So let the cost of this car over five years with those 780 credit scores, this car is costing you just over $1,200. $1,219.52. The cost of financing the same $25,000 at a 7% interest rate is $4,701. And the total cost of the same $25,000 with a 500 credit scores at a 29.95% interest rate is $23,484. With the 500 credit scores, the cost of the cars are almost double. So at the end, with the 500 credit scores, the, your total cost is $48,484. I wanna challenge you right now. If you're financing one of these high cost loans, make it one of your, make it one of your mission. We, we in July, so this is a little bit over half of the year. Take the rest of the year and work on your credit. Comes 2020, in the next six months, refinance that sucker and keep more of your money in your pocket. This is my challenge for the rest of the year. You will be surprised how many doors will be open for you just working on your credit. You won't have to be at the mercy of any lenders. Instead, you line everybody up and ask them, what do you have to offer me? And if they don't have anything beneficial to you, next, and until you find a lender 
that will offer you what you're looking for. You on the driver's side. You on the driver's side, baby. So yes, this is why we talk about credit. To help you keep more of your own money in your pocket. And number two, please give us a thumbs up. <laughs> and again, guys, my name is Paul with Sunset Realty. Please subscribe so you don't miss any of our next videos. Peace.